Hey folks, welcome back. Law Creations here. Uh, just wanted to do an update video of uh, my newest, my newest creation that I just got, uh, just finished up. It's a, uh, I made it for my custom Punisher. Uh, just an accessory to go along with him. It's a uh, weapons cache, weapons box. Uh, just to go along with uh, the theme of the Punisher. And I ended up using a nice Bad Mother's tattoo decal here. I kind of went over it with some paint just to make it a little brighter, but everything's uh, everything's made out of wood, and everything's uh, handcrafted and just uh, painted and and made to look weathered. And I have I have two things I need to add. I want to add like a lock here, and I want to add straps on the sides to give it more of an authentic authentic feel to it. But uh, let's take a look at the inside. The inside has uh, just uh, just an area, a top tray to stash weapons and and uh, put whatever uh, whatever is uh, convenient for the Punisher that day to uh, take along with him or to stash somewhere. And uh, I put some felt on the bottom of that tray and I painted it white and just gave it like a gray a gray dry brush kind of just to uh just to accentuate the uh the felt a little bit and i added some straps because this particular piece comes out and you can put it you know on the side here and voila there's a second second shelf over here let me move this so it doesn't tumble and let's take a look and i just did some more storage areas for uh, weapons and uh, I did the same thing with the felt. I gave it a couple compartments for the silences. There's shotgun in there, a whole bunch of automatic weapons. And uh, that's what I went ahead and did. It took a couple days to make. Everything is made out of wood. And I just used my miter saw, my hand miter saw, to cut things to size and and to try to get it in scale with the uh, with the Punisher uh, figure. So that's what I went ahead and did, guys. Uh, Let's uh, let's close it up, and I'll show you guys uh, the outside of the box, just to give you a quick overview of it. But that slides in there nicely, and then you just close it up, and there's the box. But that's what it looks like, guys. That's the sides. Obviously, the back with some hinges, and the other sides. Like I say, I want to add some straps to make it look. Uh, pretty cool and here it is in comparison to the uh, in scale with the Punisher figure it's a perfect scale for this particular figure if you guys can see that but yeah so I just wanted to show you guys uh, my newest creation and I just sat down I did some measuring and I just said hey why not uh, let's let's give it a shot and I have to tell you guys that's what I do most of the time I get an idea and I just sit down and I try to do it. I googled some uh, some pictures of uh, of uh, like ammo boxes or weapons cache and I, I got some odds and ends uh, pictures, some ideas and I probably took a little bit from each and just went ahead and made this particular box. I didn't watch any uh, YouTube videos on it because there's really not anything out there on, on how to's. I just sat down and did it. And uh, I wasn't going to get discouraged if it didn't come out good. or uh, But it's it's all learning. I, I like to sit down and just uh, just go at it. Just do it. Just uh, have a blast doing it. And when it comes out nice, uh, it's a great feeling. But uh, I, we're all at different levels of customizing. Uh, there's people that do way better work than me. And I, I like to consider myself uh, getting better every day. Because I, I, I like to think I... Uh, I put some time in to try to to try to get better and uh, if you're just beginning don't ever get discouraged because uh, you'll get there you'll accomplish the pieces you want you'll accomplish the looks that you want don't get discouraged uh, just it's a hobby have fun doing it have fun creating and do what you love all right guys I just wanted to show you this this piece you guys enjoy your day and have a good rest of the weekend